Mastering English grammar, using articles, a, an, the, with nouns. Hello, English learners. Welcome back to our channel, where we're dedicated to helping you improve your language skills. Today, we're diving into an essential topic, using articles, a, an, the, with nouns. Understanding how to use these articles correctly is a crucial step toward clear and effective communication. Stick around, as we break down the rules and provide practical examples to ensure you get it right every time. Let's get started. The Basics of Articles Before we delve into the specifics, let's establish a foundation. Articles are small words that come before nouns to give us more information about the noun. There are two types of articles, indefinite articles, a and an, and the definite article, the. When to use a and an. Using indefinite articles. When to use a and when to use an can sometimes be confusing. It all boils down to the sound that the following noun starts with. Use a before words that start with consonant sounds and then before words that start with vowel sounds. The definite article the. Using definite article. The is the definite article, and it's used to specify a particular noun that both the speaker and the listener are familiar with. For example, if we're talking about a specific book, we would use the to refer to that particular book. When not to use articles. Omitting articles. There are times when you don't need to use any article. For instance, with plural and uncountable nouns, or when referring to general concepts. We'll walk you through these scenarios to make sure you understand when articles should be omitted. Congratulations! You've now unlocked the secrets of using articles, a, an, the, with nouns. This knowledge will undoubtedly enhance your communication skills and help you express yourself more clearly. Remember to practice regularly and pay attention to context when choosing the right article. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and turn on notifications so you won't miss any of our upcoming grammar lessons. Thanks for joining us today, and happy learning! For more engaging English language content, tips, and tutorials, stay tuned to our channel. Until next time, keep learning and keep improving. See you in the next video.